Did you have to embarrass me on camera by pulling my chin hairs? Did you really have to do that on camera? Like, as long as we've been at this, you couldn't have done that before I pressed record? Hello everyone, Lot Gardener Bird Lady here coming to you guys with a quick video. In this video here, I want you to talk about the important benefits the sun has on our parents and even ourselves. So, let's jump right into it. So much for stopping by my channel if this is not your first time welcome back if this is your first time welcome 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 i hope that you do decide to join the family and stay by hitting that like button that subscribe button and of course as always ring that bell now i always have to put this out here this is a very diverse channel i do try to keep most of my topics centered around parrots in some kind of way now i talk about gardening history true crime social commentary christianity um mental health issues just whatever i decide to come downstairs and talk about that day that's what i'm going to talk about because i have a whole notebook and a macbook full of researching topics that interest me guys i am so sorry while editing this video i just realized that i forgot to take my gum out of my mouth i mean i already can't talk i have a lisp I, i'm country i have a speech impairment and then i have the nerve to have some gum in my mouth so i am so so sorry every now again every now and then you are going to hear like a popping type sound um I am so sorry, but not sorry enough to record this video all the way over again. So I hope it's not too much of a distraction for you. You guys know I usually don't do this. I just completely forgot that I had it in my mouth. All right, let's get back to it. If you are here for the parent only videos out of all the other stuff I post about, make sure you turn on the notification bell so you will not miss when I post a parent center video so guys do us a really big favor and watch this video until the end i will be making an announcement at the end of this video so make sure you watch it to the end so you're excited huh get them excited about it get them excited about it tell them say wait to the end we got an announcement to make make it to the end so you heard casper watch this video to the end because we do have an announcement he's wanting to tell you guys now good thing he does he's not like the dog on um the bushes baked beans video and you can't understand what he's saying i always like to also tell you guys i am not a parrot expert I've taken, you know, little short classes when I adopted Casper, but nothing to call myself a parrot expert. I don't have any kind of credentials, any kind of licenses. I just absolutely love parrots. I love my parrots. When I found out how, how bad the parrot trade was and how many parrots are in rescues, I decided to just start doing, to, to take some of the research that I've done with making a, what I consider as a pretty good life for my parrots. I decided to start recording some of that information to help others out. So many, so many people actually compliment my parrots and compliment their, um, their feathers. And I attribute that to their health of course um and i also i actually also contribute that to they get a lot of sun so most sources actually recommend 30 minutes to an hour a day to be on the safe side and i understand for everyone it's it's not possible to put your parents outside in the where they can receive direct sunlight so if you can't put your parents outside where they receive direct sunlight what you can do is you can actually put them in front of a window where they can receive sun it's not the same the glass in our windows actually naturally block out some of the uv rays from the sun but not meaning that it's just it's better than them not having any sun or at all or having just the regular like um lights the regular LDV, L, led lights in our house on our home now if you can't do that or if you feel like the the window is a little too drafty and you don't want to risk it you can buy um artificial lighting that's made for parrots that's that's set to mimic the uv rays from the sun and it's specifically for parrots i got mine from amazon i believe it was from zoomed and i will put a link down in the description box below so that you can go and purchase one for your parrot um if you need one with that make sure that you do get the avian light for parrots not the reptile light because it is a difference so sun plays a very big part of our our parents lives and of our lives as well now this is no kind of sun worship false god type work um video 
we believe in Jesus right here. So just to let you know, just, this is the health and the mental benefits that just the natural sunlight, that vitamin D from the natural sun actually helps us. I'm going to give you 10 benefits that the sun has on our pears. Now, the first benefit is, of course, vitamin D. Vitamin D. Us, parrots, vitamin D. You can actually feed your parrots a very nutritious diet. But because they have that lack of vitamin D, they may not be able to absorb certain nutrients like calcium and phosphorus into their diets, which are very, very important. So you can give them mineral blocks, you can give them calcium, calcium purchase, things of that sort. It really doesn't do any good if they're not getting enough sun, they're not getting that vitamin D. Now, because they do have feathers, they do not absorb vitamin D into their skin the same way we do. It's actually a process. Now, they have this preening gland and what that gland does it um when they when a when a parrot preens themselves they spread that what's up baby what's up hi hello what you see what you want why you gotta put your butt in my face that's not what what you want hmm. what you want you don't want me talking about your gland you don't want me talking about Ooglan. Hmm. You don't want me talking about Ooglan. You don't? Okay. Cover your ears then because I got to talk about it. Yeah, cover your ears because I got to talk about it. Yeah. So when your pair is actually preening. What's up? Hmm? What's up? Hmm? You smell like popcorn. Why you always smell like popcorn? So when a parrot preens themselves and they and they put that oil on their feathers to keep their feathers water resistant, the oil, the vitamin D in that oil is activated from the sun and then it's in it, it is insol it is absorbed into the skin. Man, it was hard for me to get that out. Another thing that the sun does, this is pretty much the same thing with us. It helps out with their circadian rhythm. Rhythm. It lets our body know when to go to sleep, and that's determined by the light or sunlight. Parrots are really confused when they're always kept in the dark. They don't know what's night. They don't know what's daytime. It can also also cause them, cause them to not get deep sleep or not get restful sleep. And we all know how we are when we haven't. Hey, we all know. We all know how we are when we haven't gotten a a restful night of sleep. How how irritable we are, how aggressive we, we may become, we just may become aggravated and agitated. The same thing with parrots. So if their um, circadian rhythm, rhythm is off, then it actually causes our parrots to be off because they're not getting enough sleep. It actually made it, makes it very hard for them to regenerate cells and keep a healthy brain. Cause you know they need those cells. Number three would be it prevents, the sun prevents depression. This is from someone who suffers from depression. One thing that I have found that helps is whenever I'm feeling down is of course my prayer, my Jesus, reading my Bible, that helps of course. Another thing that helps me is um, if I stay in a dark room, it seems like my depressive stages last a lot longer. But when I go outside, I do something in the garden, I just get in the sun, I do begin to feel a lot better. Number four is it does provide help provide strong bones, beaks, and feather production because that vitamin D from the sun, it actually helps to absorb calcium. And we know calcium helps with our bones. Number five, it does strengthen our parents' immune system. So depression weakens the immune system. And also, again, helping absorb that calcium actually helps uh, calcium helps build our immune system as well it actually helps now this is an important one it actually helps to prevent parasites and mites as well now the parasites that can and the mites that can attack our parrots they like humid um dark places so if your place has a lot if your parrots cages have a lot of sunlight they don't like that number seven if you did not know the sun is a natural cleaner Yes, it is. It cleans germs and bacteria off our parrot's skin. Yes, so you spraying them down with water, giving them baths, that's all good. But the sun is going to come in and give that extra. Mm. I am in no way, shape, form, or fashion, or fashion telling you to use any toxic chemicals on your parrot's cages. Now, I do have a video that I will put, put in the description box as well as I have it in the cards up here that shows you how I make a natural natural cleaning solution for my parrot's um, cages. But if something happens and there was some toxic material that was used on your parrot's cages, wash it off. Not just rinse it off, but wash it off with warm soapy water. 
rinse it off really well and then set that cage in the sun because the sun does clean or degrade that toxic or that chemical residue from substances that may have had happened to get on your parrot's cages. Number eight, it does actually also help improve their feather quality. How it does that is not only does it help the the, not only does it help the preen all go on the feathers smoothly, but the preen all actually drives out parrots as well. So it helps in that way. Like everything ties together. As you can see, everything ties together. Number nine, it actually helps with hormonal imbalances. Yes, it helps with hormonal imbalances. So if you have a hormonal parrot, your parrot is acting a little crazy. It could, a lot of times with hormones, it does have a lot to do with the light or lack thereof. So make sure you give them ad the adequate amount of sunlight and that can help with some of our parrot's hormonal imbalances as well. Now, what I'll probably do is when it comes to things like that, it's a lot that goes into it so I'll probably do a completely separate video talking about hormonal imbalances I just don't want this one to be too long and finally number 10 it makes them more social or more active one thing I notice about my parents is on a day if it's a day that's sunny or um, they've been outside they are a lot more active even though they're not really a lot really vocal a lot but they are a lot more active they're playing a lot more now on a day like this because today is a very stormy sun uh, just a very stormy droopy day on a day when they're the the weather is just the sun is not out the weather is just there that I can really tell a difference in my parents. They just really just, they're just chill all day long. And when this first happened, I thought that Casper was sick. But come to find out that, you know, just like us, when we, when it's rainy and when it's, the sun isn't out, when the weather's kind of droopy or droomy, um, is that even a word? But y'all know what I'm trying to say. If you, uh, if the weather is that way, we want to kind of lay around. We want to be chill. So the same way with our parents. So those are the 10 reasons, the 10 benefits that there are, of course, a lot more, but those are just the 10 benefits of the, the sun, that the sun has on our parents. When they get more sunlight, they tend to eat better. They tend to try more things. Um, they sleep better. They bite less. They are less noisy. I know I just said they're more social, but they're less noisy when I when you have that just ah that just screaming for no reason at all. Talking about you. Talking about you. But um, their feathers they look more especially when you have something like a sun conure. They look more iridescent. They look brighter. Like I can know I like. Danny's feathers are absolutely gorgeous. His feathers are so beautiful. Not saying that Casper's isn't, but Casper's all white. So of course his feathers are beautiful, but those different, that different colors of the rainbow spectrum that are on Danny is absolutely, it's so beautiful. And with, you know, the sun, they actually display less hormone dis behavior. Now this is a couple with 12 plus hours of sleep and a healthy diet. So if you're giving them a lot of sun, but you're not giving them a healthy diet, you're giving them a lot of sun, but you're not giving them um, a healthy diet, eh, you're still going to have some hormonal problems. So it all goes together and they do act a lot happier and less depressed when they get more sun thank you so much for watching this video i hope you made it to the end if you made it to the end of the video i do have a surprise coming for you get for you guys friday on my birthday i will be going live and doing a surprise for you guys so look out for that if you did make it to the end of the video comment down below and try to guess what the surprise is going to be and if there is a if someone guesses correctly then um i will have a prize for you thank you so much guys for watching remember to share this video share this video like comment subscribe share all those beautiful things that is a free way that you can help out the channel and make sure you click down in the description box below there will be a link to the um zoom med lamp avian lamp that i use and um yeah buy it from my link it doesn't actually cost you any less you don't get a discount for it just being transparent but it is you know a way if you're gonna buy it anyway it is a way that you can actually help out my channel um thank you so much guys for watching and as usual you gonna say toodaloo thank you so much guys for watching and as usual toodaloo bye bye, bye. <laughs> you gonna say bye 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 bye, bye.